What is good, High Heat fam? Your boy is back, and we're back to another controversial video. Ah, boy, so we're back at it again. Who are we gonna talk about today? Uh, the fucking cuck himself, Schneeko. Schneeko's just going viral right now, and because they're just talking about the fucking sparring he had with the former champ, Sean Strickland. And, uh, I ain't gonna lie, Sneeko got his ass beat. Oh. Now here's where we could go with this. Yeah, we could respect Sneeko for going in, but also, why the fuck did you think a spar was gonna be fucking safe for you? Yeah, oh yeah, we're gonna spar. And yeah, don't get me wrong, sparring is just to practice and get better. But like, bro, you have like close to no experience. You don't know how to fucking fight, Sneeko. And you're going against a guy that's been doing this his whole life. You're gonna get beat. I don't know what you thought the outcome for this was gonna be. However, I will respect you for the reason of going in, but I also think you're kind of stupid for even going in the first place, you know? Like this guy breathes and trains and does this for a living and you thought you weren't gonna come out unscathed? No. At this point, we've got a lot of reactions, especially from KSI saying he's like, you know what, even though me and Sneeko had our differences, I respect it. And you know what's the worst part, bro? I like how they threw in not one towel, not two towels, three towels until some fucking guy just had to step in and stop it from fucking going overboard now i'm not gonna lie i don't like how everybody else is also just filming this and like oh we're gonna react to this yeah yeah when nobody really even cared about sneeko's health types of friends that sneeko has people that don't give a single fuck about him i'm not even gonna lie i'm just surprised from the whole outcome and even jake paul called out sean strickland to be like you know what i don't like how you beat up sneeko so let's go have a fucking spar. One million on the purse if Sean Strickland beats him. But if Jake Paul beats him, he's got to get a better tattoo. <laughs> Look at the high heat. <laughs> Subscribe. But he will get a better tattoo on his arm and that will be that. But obviously because Sean Strickland is under the UFC, he really can't do that. So eh, it is what it is. But Sean Strickland did say this. What do you think about Jake Paul? Are you gonna fly for a million and fucking box him? What do you think about that kid? I think UFC would fucking sue the fuck out of me if I did that. But yes, I would do it in a heartbeat. Oh, yeah. They would sue the fuck out of me, but... Go out the desert, bro. I'm your man, bro. Just you got the plane. Show up. So yeah, you never know. This could be some fucking Mad Max shit going on, you know? It could fucking all go down. Anyone could take the fucking belt. I'm getting too over-exaggerated. Sorry, I literally did watch Mad Max the other day. But yeah, boys, I don't know. Like Jake Paul's fueling in the fucking fire. Sean's are gonna just beat the fuck out of a cuck. And I don't know. And Sneeko just keeps taking fucking L's because I'm not gonna lie. This happened to fucking Sneeko as well. Oh, 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 everybody, there's like 20 people waiting for you. Come with me. Um, T, yes. can you please wait with Sneeko? Yes. Okay. Oh. okay, perfect. They're with you? Yes. Yeah, Speed and Kai just completely ignored him, which I, I don't blame him because Sneeko is a clown. Oh, and that's not the other part. Guess who else ignored him? Steve will do it. Look. Oh. Sorry. Right, Damn, man. I don't know. Because so. I'm, I'm on my bubble or something? Uh -huh. What's your problem? Miss Reed. Miss I don't know what's going on. Hey. Yeah, I don't know what game this is either. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I think Sneeko is just a walking out at this point. As y'all can see, I hate the fucking guy. Yeah, but overall, I'm really disappointed in Sean Strickland for doing that. However, he did give him like four minutes to just punch him, whatever. But then again, like he's a fucking trained ufc fighter does this for a living i'm pretty sure sneeko just had some brains enough to like think i'm not gonna go in there because i'm gonna get my ass beat and probably get actual injuries and apparently he thought nah fuck it i'm gonna go in and still got his ass beat now he didn't drop so that is respect but still is it worthy because of your fucking health i don't know if it's worth it but yeah boys that happened with sneeko still being an l sean strickland definitely i'm not gonna lie i fuck with sean strickland still but a little bit of my fucking Respect has gone down the drain because of that. And then Wade Plam, I do like his video. If you guys want, just check out his video. I think he did a better debrief of this. And Jake Paul called him out. And yeah, that's not really going to happen because of the whole UFC. But you know what, boys? It was an interesting event, if you want to call it that. Bad boys, I want you guys to comment down if you guys want me to go over anybody else in the industry. Any situations, any fucking tea or whatever the fuck the girls call it nowadays. But yeah, boys, 
Comment down, like, subscribe, and share. And peace!